Well, it's a hard league. That's one. Um, I think you can play good hockey and not get points, and play, you know, and, and that's just the reality of the league. I think, uh, uh, you know, I think I would have said that up until, you know, the last five periods. The last five periods haven't been good enough. I, I think prior to that, you know, I had a conversation with uh, with Ken Holland on the way home on the plane from Montreal, and. You know, even the three games previous, two against LA, and then the first period against Montreal were real good. You know, but then the last five haven't been good enough. Before that, I think part of it's just the league. It's going to be a little bit of ebb and flow. I think there's, uh, you know, uh, this team didn't start great, and all of a sudden they're great. You know, uh, other teams have gone in and out. Uh, uh, you see teams start to go on stretches. So I think the biggest thing that 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 plays into uh, these types of deals is confidence. And nobody gives you confidence magically. You got to go earn it, and you got to go earn it by finding a way to win, uh, and then and then hopefully build from there. You hey, told Jeff, us the, the the opinion from maybe some of the outsiders is that your message isn't getting through to the players. Did you? I heard the Kaiser talking about it the last couple of days. They definitely got the message. Did you buy that sort of thing, and why do you think the message has or hasn't got through? Well, I I certainly don't buy it. I think uh, you know as I go through this team, I think they're bought in as much as I ever since I've been here. To be honest with you, um, that doesn't mean that we've played great. That doesn't mean the results have been there. But but from a message standpoint, um, I think they understand uh, what it, how we need to play to win. Um, they understand uh, those types of things. So I don't think that's been the case at all. Uh, that doesn't, you know, obviously the performance in Montreal was, was abysmal. Um, but I don't think it has anything to do with the message not getting in, to be dead honest with you. I wouldn't doubt Henrik Zetterberg. He said yesterday he loved how practice went, said it was kind of a unique deal with all the drills and the battle drills. Is that something the two of you talked about? Did he come to you and say, we need to do this more? Was that all your call? How, how did yesterday develop into the practice it was? No, it wasn't. Uh, him and I didn't have a conversation about practice. Uh, we just, first of all, you know, in the in the schedule, the NHL, you don't have enough days where you can do that. Um, you, you have to do it coming off a day off, uh, mo most likely, because you have to have energy in the games as well. But uh, as we looked at the, the tape, we didn't spend enough time. You know, we had good four-check opportunities, got the puck, and didn't hold on to it. we got to be a team that's ultra-competitive. We don't have big size, uh, so we've got to be a team that's ultra-competitive and, and winning puck battles, and that was what we emphasized yesterday. That was from our coaching staff.